Your Defense Secretary Jim Mattis has been briefed, and the top American general in charge of all U.S. forces in the Middle East and Afghanistan issued this strongly worded statement, quote, I have reviewed the video and I am disappointed and also concerned that the American people, our coalition partners, the Afghan government and the Afghan people will believe that American service members are callous and indifferent to the horrors of war or the suffering of innocent people trapped in conflict. Now, what's missing in this video is context. It's unclear what prompted what appears to be a U.S. special operator firing into the window of a civilian truck in eastern Afghanistan, where roughly a 1,000 ISIS-affiliated fighters are located. Officials tell me a non-lethal round might have been used. You can see the driver's window getting shot out, but no blood on the windshield. But General Votel went on to say this video does not represent the professionalism of the nearly 14,000 U.S. troops currently deployed to Afghanistan. Sandra? Lucas, it seems like the U.S. military is ramping up operations in Afghanistan. It is, Sandra. In the past year, three times more bombs were dropped in Afghanistan than the year before, and more U.S. jets are on the way. Now, the majority of those bombs being dropped in Afghanistan are being fired on that ISIS affiliate in eastern Afghanistan, and many of the 3,000 U.S. troops recently deployed will be moving closer to the front lines to help call in more airstrikes. And Sandra, you can expect in the coming days more jets will be sent to Afghanistan.